Then you have to think about, can I get creative mm -hmm. in, my, in, in reducing the amount of capital that will be required to, as a total portion of my operating cash, mm -hmm be dedicated to inventory. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of ways to do that. There are inventory financing programs, there's warehouse lines, mm -hmm. they call them, and things like that. Um, you can also factor your receivables mm -hmm. for inventory that you've sold and then take that and apply it to inventory that you're buying. Mm -hmm. Inventory financing direct from the manufacturer was, is another way that you can do it. So you basically go to the manufacturer and particularly if you're overseas, you say, listen, I'll pay you a third when I place the order, a third when it lands, and a third 30 days after it sells, mm -hmm. or they'll say a third when you receive it. But the more that you can get that finance, the better. There are programs called container financing programs. So if you're shipping containers of product to you, from overseas or even domestically. There are people that actually finance the container all the way to, uh, to receiving it. There are private money investors that will do uh, private money inventory financing. You can do, one of the things that we found to offset the cost of inventory is that we sell leads so we have an inventory-based business, so you would think, okay, well, the only thing you can do there is wait for the inventory to come, mm -hmm. and then when somebody buys it, you ship it out. What we do is we actually sell the leads when we have somebody that first comes in before they even get to the point of buying the inventory. And so we sell those leads to other people that don't compete with us. Mm -hmm. um, another thing that you can do is, um, is have your... Uh, have it done on a drop ship basis so that you get the payment from the customer now and then you your inventory company mm -hmm. holds the inventory and then ships it directly to the consumer when you get an order. So you've already been paid, you don't have any financing there. Mm -hmm. um, they'll also do inventory consignment where they'll manufacture inventory and provide it to you in your warehouse. They'll get a security interest, which is a legal thing that protects them, but so that they, they own it, but it's consigned to you in your warehouse and you don't have to pay for it until it ships. Uh, and then just getting general terms, that would be another way to do it. So that's a few things.